I recently got this pair of Z-Bend pliers and I just couldn't wait to do a review uh, and, and just to tell you uh, what I think of them. I've been struggling for years making my own Z-Bends. I mean, Z-Bends are pure simplicity in themselves. They're a great uh, idea, they work lovely and we probably all use them in our builds to control some of the linkages one way or another. I've always been sceptical about Z-Bend pliers, thinking that well, perhaps they don't work, and for years I've struggled making absolutely rubbish Z-Bends, something that I really didn't like doing, mainly because I didn't do a very good job. And I saw a review, a friend of mine, Jerry at RC Tail Dragging, and he's got a, a, a brilliant YouTube site RC Tail Dragging as well as a Facebook site so, so go and check that out but he did a he did a review of a pair of Z-Bend pliers and I thought you know what they look really good but I was still not totally sold but he did make them look really good so I thought well I'll invest and I got myself a pair of pliers and boy are they absolutely wonderful they produce the loveliest, crispest Z-Bends you could wish for. For me, it's no more rubbishly trying to bend them by hand. These Z-Bend pliers are brilliant, and I'll just show you how they work. Okay, well, here are our Z-Bend pliers, just like a, a normal set of, uh, of pliers or cutters, except they've got a modified end. They've got like a, a, a set of teeth in there that when crimped together puts that Z-Bend shape into the wire and they just squeeze together lovely and firm. Uh, they also have a, if I can get this to focus okay, just in the in the end of the teeth there they have a little bit of a groove, just see that hopefully, and on the other side that groove is also there, you can just see it there and that's to hold the wire nice and secure when you're making the Z-Bend. Now if I show you how we make the Z-Bend, we have a control horn like this and if we have a piece of wire which we want to put the Z-Bend into, we decide where that first bend needs to be, so uh, in line with the hole in the control horn, so the first right angle bend and where that needs to be we just put a little bit of a mark like that lined up with the hole where it needs to be so there we go we have our hole and we just line up the mark with that hole then we take our pliers and we put the wire in the pliers like that and if it's located in those grooves on either side it'll just we just crimp it, hold it, sorry, hold it slightly, it'll just slide backwards and forwards nice and secure without falling out. And the thing we need to do is we need to line up the first bend with this cusp here. So our control lines coming, our control linkage is, is coming down here and then we want it to dive this bit here to go through the control horn. So we line it up with that tooth, with that cusp like that. And then we just hold them and we give them a nice tight crimp. It's all it takes. There's nothing flimsy about this. This is a, a really solid positive, uh, positive grip. And then there we have our perfect Z-Bend that comes out just as we as we want. That is lovely. And we can just then push that through the control horn and uh, and there we go. Wrong way around perhaps, but, but there you go. We have our perfect control linkage which is nice and secure. And as you can see from that, the Z-Bends are really good. And so I just had to do another review and just tell you how good these pliers are. And I mean, I think I paid about £12 sterling for these, so they're not hugely expensive. These ones were supplied by, uh, by Logitech RC, uh, but I mean they're made in Taiwan, they've got Taiwan stamped on, on both sides. 
Jerry's were from Hangar 9, I believe, and I saw they had Taiwan and the same. And I suspect most of these pliers come out of the same factory. But I thought they might be a little bit flimsy, take a lot of work to produce that Z bend. But boy, as you've seen, they, they really are good. These are a revelation to me. So I can't recommend getting anything. Uh, as much as I can getting a pair of these. These are brilliant. So I had to share that with you guys.